Another type of control chart you won't find anywhere else except in the QI macros and some statistics books is a trend control chart. And what this does is anytime you have something like fixed costs, which is always increasing in cost because of inflation or whatever, it's very difficult to draw a control chart of that. You're right, because this will just go out of control and you won't know what's going on. But the XMR trend chart will actually track that and convert that into uh, control limits that go right along with it. So if you select some data here, we have our fixed costs over here. In the QI macros, we can come down and choose XMR trend chart. It'll go do all the calculations for that and draw a standard range chart. And then it'll come back and draw the trend chart. And so here you can see our whole trend and process and so on. And as you can see, it'll go calculate things like how useful the fit is. So is, is R squared better, greater, greater than 0.8? And yes, it is. And what's our sigma level? And what's our probability? What's the slope? So, you know, our fixed costs are rising. How much can we count on all of that? And those kinds of things uh, are useful, I think, in any situation where you have data that's always trending in one direction or another. And this chart would assist you in drawing that. You can download a 30-day trial of the QI Macros at QIMacros.com.